little bit of an update on this uh, LTO bank of mine. I've uh, brought it uh, back online. It is. Um, I've got another active balancer there. Um, you can just see the uh, layout of it. I've got, I'm going to put a DIN rail at the back and mount the uh, this active balancer on the back. And also I've got a, a DIN mounted Raspberry 4 running a uh, Victron software. It is a mount on the DIN rail that I'm going to put across where all that blank is. Uh, I've got both uh, two PV arrays going in. They're only, well, I think, about 350 watts of uh, arrays on each. Um, yeah, so I'm running two of those. I've got some more breakers to come. They're a little bit high, high capacity, those ones. And I've just got this uh, Phoenix 48 800 watt. Uh, inverter that I picked up uh, ages ago. I picked up two of them actually uh, for just under two hundred dollars each, brand new. There's no VE direct port in these ones. They're an earlier model. So um, yeah, so at the moment it's actually uh, running me a little Raspberry Pi and me a little USB uh, uh, power supply. I've got a little um, DC to DC. Uh, isolated power supply to go in here that'll give me five volts so I'll run it off the actual battery banks uh, themselves so uh, yes I'm quite uh, quite pleased with it so far uh, a little bit more to go a little bit of tweaking but uh, all is uh, all's good um, yeah